Hi, I'm Mira. Welcome to Flow with Mira. We have an advanced full body workout today. It's an athletic mat, so make sure you are comfortable in your advanced Pilates exercises to join this class. So let's go, let's have some fun. Come to the mat. We're gonna start the class standing at the back of the mat. So finding our tall standing position, feet are parallel, just check they are parallel. And lengthening the spine, deep inhalation to start. And exhalation. Let's do one more time, inhale. And then as we exhale, let's start rolling the spine down, starting from the tip of the head, coming to the neck, the upper back, middle back, lower back, and the pelvis will tip forward. Take yourself closer to the floor. Soften the knees if you need to. In breath. Exhale. Let's start stacking up the spine. Bring the pelvis upward, lower spine, middle spine, upper spine, head and neck floating away. Again, in breath. Exhale. Let's roll it down again. So we are going to move quite briskly in this class today. It is an athletic mat, so... Beware that you are going to be challenged physically in breath. Exhale. But of course, keeping the integrity of the movement on each exercises and lifting up the spine in breath. One more time. Exhale. Let's roll it down. Now, here, as we go down, we're going to stay at the bottom. We're going to walk your hand out to a downward facing dog position or the upstretch position and send the pelvis up to the sky find that nice stretch of the back of your leg broad shoulder long neck we in breath exhale and just stay in this position in breath sending the pelvis out exhale drawing the abdominal in two more breath inhale Exhale. One more. And let's prance our feet, lifting one heel up. And switch. And switch. In breath. In breath. Exhale. In breath. Exhale. Inhale. Last set, in breath, lift both heels up, lift the pelvis up, lengthen the spine, elongate the neck, lower the heels down and go ahead and bend the knees and go down to a quadruped position, align your shoulder and your wrist. Take the left hand behind your head and we're going to rotate our trunk towards the right side, following me. And into a chest opener as we inhale and rotate out and up. Exhale, we rotate towards the right. Rotate away from Rotate out. One more. In breath. Rotate out and up, back to the center. Left hand down, right hand behind your head. Rotate towards the left side, I'm rolling towards you. And inhale and rotate away, facing me and over to you. And inhale, rotate away from the left. And two more, exhale. In breath. One last. Exhale. In breath. And back to the center. Release the hand down. Back to our quadruped. Tuck the toes under here. Take an in breath. 
Exhale as we draw in the lower abdominal. We flatten our lower spine slightly and float the knees off. We stay in our little plank position here, modified plank that is, for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, strong arm, strong core, 4, 3, 2, we stay, extend the left leg out, tuck the toes under, engage your hip extensors, the back of your legs, and second leg out, just under, and we stay, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, we stay, bend the knees to the panther, bring the pelvis back, and forward, over your wrist, and two more, bring the pelvis back, bend the knees, and forward, over the wrist, Last one, into panther, and forward over the wrist, and send the pelvis back again. This time, step your right foot forward, step the left foot forward, sit the pelvis down to the floor, hands behind, feet forward, legs together. Take the arms forward. We're gonna roll down, we're gonna take it straight to the hundreds. All right, let's go. We round our back, we roll down, Get that chest lift position. Then we're gonna drag the legs up, tabletop, palms down. Shoot the legs to appropriate height for you today. Inhale, lift. Exhale, we go. A sense of deepening as you exhale. A sense of floating up as you inhale. Reach those legs long, engage those legs muscle. Three more. Last here. We stay, drag the knees, drag the knees, drag the knees to the forehead. One leg comes down, second leg comes down. You sit in the chest lift, straighten the legs, one and two. Turn the palms in, we're gonna go to the roll up. Drag, not drag, pull the abdominal in and lift up to that C curve. In breath, exhale, we go down for the roll ups, arms overhead. Arms up to the sky, up to the chest lift, draw the abs in, and then lift up with that hip flexors into that C curve. Inhale, lengthen as you pull the abs in, and exhale, we roll back to the chest lift. Make sure you get this checkpoint here. Then head down, arms overhead, and we go arms up. The first checkpoint is your chest lift position. Then you draw in, tilt the pelvis back. Then we get into our secret position. Inhale, lift the spine as you draw the abdominal deeper. Then we go back to that chest lift checkpoint and head down, arms overhead. Two more, arms up and lift. And up over the pelvis in breath. Exhale, we go down. One last here. We're gonna stay up in the seated position. Exhale, we lift, 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 lift. Bend the knees, bring the feet in to the rolling like a bowl. So we are gonna do three versions of rolling like a bowl. The first one is the normal classic rolling like a bowl, and then we're gonna combine it rolling like a bowl with a roll over, and then rolling like a bowl with a squat. Are you ready? So let's go ahead, find our beautiful balance position, and let's do three of this. Inhale, we roll back. Exhale, C curve. Inhale, roll back. Exhale, balance, balance, balance. One more, roll back. Exhale, balance, balance. Then rolling like a ball with rollover. So we go roll back, let go of the arms, press the arms down, bring the leg over the face. 
Then bend the knees, tuck the feet in, and catch yourself rolling like a ball. Got that? Let's go. And roll over. Bend the knees, catch the legs, and balance. Let's go. Three more. Inhale. Legs straight and arms down. Make sure you do not turn your head towards me as you do this. If you need to watch me, watch me first, then rewind the video. And arms down, legs over. Bend the knees. And, and roll. And bend the knees. And balance. One last. And we go. Roll. Bend the knees. And balance. Let's do four rolling like a ball with a squat. And we go roll. And then feet down. Lift. Half squat. And then this is what I did. What I've taught in the intermediate athletic mat class. And so we do the same way. Over and pull. Press the feet. And lift. And two more legs together. Roll over. Not roll over. Rolling like a ball. I said the wrong thing. And squat. Last one, and then we're gonna stay in the squat position and stand up. All right, step your left leg back into a lunge position here. Vertical alignment, front knee and the heel, back toes, straight and strong back leg, arms out to the side like the Titanic. That's what I like to tell my students. Now here, bending the back knee, curling the back press it up, and, and in down. Exhale, shoot back, and inhale. Exhale, three more, inhale. Exhale, two. Exhale, Last, we stay down, arms come up, little pulses, and we go, inhale, and two, two, inhale, and three, three, inhale, and four, four, inhale, last five, five, inhale, and stay down, straighten the back leg, lean the body forward, front heel up, and down. And two, and down, and three. Make sure the knee is over the heel. Four, last one, five. Now stay down, step the back leg forward, squat. We come up, got that. All right, other side, we got the right leg back. Big step behind you. Align the knee and the heel. Arms out to the Titanic, out to the side, and we go down. Exhale, curl the pelvis and bring the knee underneath you. Extend, and extend, and two more, three more, sorry, and back. Two more now, and back. One more now. And back, no, we're gonna stay down. I forgot, take the arms out, little pulses. How can I forget this? And we go down, two, inhale. And two, two, in breath. And three, three, in breath, it is spicy. And four, four, inhale. And five, five, inhale. We stay, straighten the back leg, lean the body forward. Then plant our flex the front, heel up. Down, and two, down, and three, down, two more, down, last, and then step the back leg forward, catch yourself, and we come up, roll down to the floor. We go, gracefully, we roll the spine down, then deep squat, hands behind your pelvis. Step forward, your feet are parallel, and we roll back. Roll back to the chest lift, bring the feet closer towards the bottom, arms long by the side, chest is open. Two pelvic curl for me, please. We go up, we press up, 
lift that pelvis high. Use the glute, use the hamstrings, press the arms, and down, down, down. Again, the next time we stay up, we've got shoulder bridge. Roll it up, roll it up, roll it high. Press the left foot down. Take the right leg straight up to the sky. And we go, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Three, two, one. We stay, point will lift and stay for five, four, three, two, one. Bend the knee, foot comes down, readjust the pelvis, left leg up, straight it up, and we go. Inhale, two, and try to keep the pelvis nice and even here. Three more, two, one. We stay, we point and lift up, stay. Five, four, three, two, one. Bend the knee, foot comes down, reestablish the pelvis, and we roll the spine down, back to your start position. Legs up one, legs up two, Open arms to a T position, spine twist, supine with double leg extension. Over to me as we in breath. We extend, bring the legs back, and we fall. And to you, and inhale, and extend. Come back. We fall, and breath, and extend. Come back. We fall and to you and extend make sure you anchor the shoulders down here so it's not about a stretch although it does feel good to stretch but it's more about connecting to your oblique muscle and last one we twist we extend we come back and keep the leg extended hamstring pull one two three we lift up Hands to the back of your calf, lift the chest higher, use that bicep to help you up. Left leg comes down, right leg stay with you. Pull the right leg to your face. We go, and, 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 two more sit, last, Hamstring pull to hands behind the head and last set. Hamstring pull three, twist, twist. Two more. Last set. Both legs are up. Grab the back of your calf. Can we lift a little higher? Higher, higher. Then we bend the knees. And head down. Arms along by the side. Two, roll over. Then jack knives. We go. Straighten. And roll over. We flex the feet. We separate them. We lower the feet down. Press down to the floor if you can. Lift the pelvis higher. And we roll back. Bottom is down. Point the feet. Reach the legs away. Close the legs. And one more. And roll over. Make sure those arms are active here. We flex the feet. And separate. And down. And again, do not turn your head towards me here. Look up to the sky, to the ceiling, with, during this rollover. And let's go to your jackknife here. Bring the legs up. And roll over. We tap down. We lift from the upper back, middle back, lower back. Go vertically up. And roll down. Legs to 60. Back to 90. Then roll over, hip flexion, lower the feet down, 
lift from the middle back, lower spine, and free up the hip joint so you can go into more hip extension here. And we roll back down to the floor. Again, do not turn your head towards me. If you need to watch me, watch me first, then rewind the class, bring the leg up and roll over. Then hip flexion, lift upper back, middle back, lower back, free up your pelvis, free up your hips, legs straight up and we go down. All right, one more and up we go and over we go and down with the legs, up with the spine, up the pelvis, up with the legs, vertically up as much as you can, roll back down and to 90, to 60, back to tabletop, lower one foot, second foot, <sighs> big breath out, stretch your legs out one and two, we have our neck pull, interlacing the hands behind your head. What we're going to do is let's do a modified neck pull and then you can choose to join me to do the full neck pull here. So legs together like you would do roll ups, the elbows are lifted. We lift the chest, look forward, let go of the arms, come up, transfer the hands back, and then deep C curl, dive the head down towards the leg, and flat back, lean. To a certain point where you kind of need to go into that curl. And down to the floor, again, inhale, arms forward, come up, hands behind the head and dive down, lift through the spine, keep the spine long, lean back and then deep curl, deep curl, deep curl and then go right down. Now we're going to do the full one here, the classic way. So we do not let go of the arms. We inhale, the deep curl, pull the abs in. If you need to let go of the arm, you may, but try, 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 try if you can. Keep the hands behind your head here, but don't yank your head. Don't yank the neck, lift the spine, lean back, and curl, 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 all the way down again, in breath, and pull in and up, over and lift, think through the spine, leaning back, rounding down. We've got one more here, and lift, round, getting harder and harder, but we made it, dive down. We lift through the spine, lengthen up tall, lean back, round back, round back, round back, and ta-da. Stretch the arm closer to me, over, bend the opposite leg, turn your body, face me, and come up onto your knee. We've got side kick, kneeling, side bend, and a twist, shall we? Let's go arms up. All right, make sure the knees are directly underneath the hip joint, you're not going too wide here. Right, well, let's go to your right first. Let's take your body to your right. Lift the bottom, lift the bottom, lift the outside leg up. Top hand behind. Now I need to push away towards the top leg. Extend, elbow suspended up. We go, inhale, and in breath, and in breath. Two more set, last set. Back, back to the side, bring it down a little extra. Bottom leg lift, bring it behind. Take the top arm up, we stay. Bend the bottom knee, shoot it forward, shoot it back. Three more, shoot it forward, shoot it back. Two more, shoot it forward, shoot it back. Last one, forward. Shoot it back, bring it behind, bring it in, and then just come up. Let us quick lateral stretch 
and bring the leg in. Other side, we go. Side over, hand behind, push away, extend the leg, we flex, we go. And three more sets. Two. Last. Back. Back to the side. Take it down. And take the bottom back. Top arm up. Ready? Let's go. And we take it forward. That's the bottom leg. And take it back. And take it forward. And take it back. Two more. Take it forward. And take it back. Last one, take it forward and take it back, take it behind, take it in. We come up, lateral stretch and side, bring it in, sit down onto your right side for the side bend and a twist. Let's just do four of this. So we got a beautiful mermaid position to start and let's go. Shoot the body over the wrist and take it up and over as you look down to the bottom here and look forward to me. Lift the pelvis high, twist back to the back and forward to me. Keep the legs straight, go down, then you bend and we bounce it up again and side over, side bend, forward to me. Lift the pelvis, pivot, and arms back. Over to me. Down, we bend. Two more, left. And side bend. And up. And pelvis up. Arms back. And to me. And smile. Down and bend. Last one, left. Over to me. Lift the pelvis, rotate, engage the back muscle. To me, down we bend and we swing the other side. Messy hair, here we go. Shall we, other side. We go straighten to the plank. Side over, you look down. And up. And lift the pelvis, rotate. And forward to me. We drop the pelvis, we bend. And we lift and side over. And front. Lift the pelvis, we rotate. And face forward. And down with the pelvis and bend the knee. Again, up. Side over. And up. Lift the pelvis. Rotate. Really try to engage the back muscle here, guys. And open. And bend. And last one. Side up. Side bend over. And forward to me. Lift the pelvis. Engage the back muscle here. And rotate back to me. Down we bend. And good job. Onto a front. We've got double leg kick. So onto our belly and turn your head to me. Interlace the hand and lift the arms as high as you can on the back. Legs are together. Okay, shall we? Lift the abdominal muscle. Lift the legs off into hip extension. Three kicks, please. One, two, three. Extend the legs. Lift the arms, lift the back. Head over to the other side. We go, kick. Two, three, and left. In breath, left. Other way, kick. Two, three, in breath, left. Left, left, again. Kick, two, three, in breath, left, left. Again, kick, 
two, three. Inhale, lift. Lift, legs are together, by the way. And last kick, two, three. Inhale, lift. We stay, we hold, take the arms forward, drop the head a little bit, open the legs, and right arm, left leg for the swimming. Left arm, right leg, and we go, in breath. Exhale, in breath. Exhale, make sure those limbs are long here. Inhale, we move up and down in the shoulder joint and the hip joint, and in. Three more. Two. One. Stay, legs together, arms to the T position, bend the knees, grab the ankles. We've got rocking prep, and we're gonna do rocking today. So, make sure you're good. You have a good grip around the ankles, and we shot. We go, press that pubic bone down to the floor, pull up the belly, lift the thigh, lift the back, extend the knees, lift everything up, and down, 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 again. Then, lift, back, legs, more legs, more back, more everything, and down, down. Two more, egg, pubic bone, belly, thighs, chest, knees, up. And we go down. Next one, we stay up. We're gonna do some rocking. Again, inhale, pubic bone, thighs, leg. We stay forward, back, back. Engage those hamstrings, back, back. Three, let's do more. Five, four, three, two, one lift, and come down. Release, forearm on the side of the shoulders, push up, round the belly in, sit back, whoop, rest position, and send the pelvis down. Just a moment. You can rock the pelvis left and right. Let's catch our breath. Two more. Last one. And roll it up. Okay, we're not done yet. We've got our front support three ways. When I say three ways, the traditional way, we're gonna go forward, forward. What we're gonna do, forward, forward. And then we go cross opposite knee, cross opposite knee, and then we go X and rotate out, out. All right, so let's give it a try. Onto our quadruped position. All right, I'm gonna come forward a little bit more here. All right, so abs in. So draw the abs in so you can flatten the lower spine. Take one leg up, plant the foot down, and get your hamstrings and the glutes. Second leg up. I'm gonna start with the right knee in first. Right knee, forward, straight forward, and back. Left one, straight forward, and back. Right knee, left elbow. So we go to obliques rotation here. Left knee, right elbow. Now, right knee outside of the right elbow. And left knee outside of the left elbow. You got that? So three ways, forward and extend. Left one, forward and extend right across to the left and left across to the right elbow. Right knee outside of right elbow. Left knee outside of left elbow. Two more sets. Forward, forward, across, across, outward, outward. Last set, forward, forward, across, across, outward, outward, and stay pelvis back to the panther. 
And in the count of three, jump the feet forward. So we go three, two, we jump. Sit down, legs forward, and we'll finish up with seal puppy. Shall we? Draw the belly in, one leg up, gracefully lift the leg up, and elbow under, hand over. Other leg. Okay, look down to the mat. Find a little bit more length in the spine while you are maintaining that secret. Like you to engage your inner thigh, at the same time, pushing the arms outwardly. All right, we go, roll back. We clap, three, two, one, go forward. Three, two, one, and back. Three, two, one, and forward. Clap, 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 and back. Clap, 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 and forward. Clap, 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 and back. Clap, 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 and forward. Clap, 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 three more. Tap, 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 forward. Tap, tap, tap. You open and close from the hip joint, not just the ankle, not just the knee. And back, tap, 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 and tap, tap, tap. Last one, tap, 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 and stay. We balance, in breath. Stay in that balance moment and just breathe. Last one. We lower the feet down, stay in that diamond leg position, just readjust the pelvis. Finding that beautiful straight line, vertical line in the spine. Just rotate the neck, left and right. Close your eyes for a moment. Bringing your attention to your breath. Deep inhalation, expanding the ribcage. Deep exhalation, let it go everything. Relax the body, relax the mind, relax the joint, relax the skin, the muscle. Keep breathing. I want you to imagine as you breathe here, your ribcage is like a piano accordion. As you inhale, you're gonna stretch that ribcage outward as wide as you can, as long as you can sideways. Then you exhale and just contract it back. And then with the exhalation, have that sense of softening through your skin, through your jaw, through your mouth, through your muscles and in bringing in a sense of grounding in the body. A sense of lightness when you breathe in. And that strong grounding feel as you exhale. One more here, please. And now from here, another inhale. Exhale, let's roll down the spine. Just let the arm to go with you. Come forward with the gravity. <sighs> Surrender. Surrender your body down to the floor. Close your eyes. Inhale, stay at the bottom. Switch off the external noises around you, but tune into the internal noise inside you. More like the internal music, I would say. One more breath. And as we exhale, we roll up again. And just allow the spine to stack naturally, voluntarily, in a beautiful upright position. Bring in your hands, palms together in front of your chest. Open your eyes and thank yourself for doing such an amazing class with me today. And I thank you for joining the class.
Thank you very much. Your star. That was one tough class. We made it. We did it. We are awesome. You're awesome. Keep the body mobile. Don't just sit down right away. Go for a walk. Make sure you hydrate yourself. And uh, I wish you a lovely, lovely, blessed day. I'll see you back on the mat tomorrow. Take care. Well done on completing this class, your star. I'm Mira, and I'm here to help you to love, look, and feel your absolute best through Pilates. If you enjoyed this video, you will love my free six-day intermediate challenge. Click the first link in the comments and join us in getting fit, strong, and feel energized with a calendar of new intermediate Pilates videos. This six-day challenge is taken from my 28 days intermediate Pilates program. If you would like to join the full 28 days, you'll find a link to my Flow with Mirror online membership in the description. See you in the next class.